Next at five, state lawmakers have proposed banning abortions in Wisconsin at 20 weeks. The controversial measure drawing support from the governor and immediate concern from women's health groups. Political reporter Jessica Arp is live at the state capitol now with more. Jessica. Well, Eric, the bill is called the Pain Capable Unborn Child Protection Act. Authors of that bill say they are proposing it to prevent fetuses from feeling pain. The bill officially circulated to get co-sponsors today. Felony to perform them at 20 or more weeks, saying a fetus at that stage is capable of feeling pain. Co-sponsors say an abortion at that stage amounts to torture. Some Democrats and women's health groups say the bill unfairly targets vulnerable women. You know, late-term abortions involve basically dismemberment. You're ripping the limbs and ripping the baby apart. That's very painful. Uh, that, that's inhumane and it's torture. And that's what we're protecting here. There is no reason that we as legislators, as politicians, should be getting involved in private medical decisions. These are decisions that are best left to those who are affected along with the medical professionals who know best. The only exception in this bill to the ban is in cases of medical emergencies. There are no exceptions for rape, incest, or fetal abnormalities. Governor Scott Walker said today that he does support this bill and hopes the legislature moves forward with the ban while it continues to work on the state budget in the Capitol today. The bill will likely be circulated for co-sponsors in the next week or so and then would likely be referred to committee and have a hearing sometime after that. A story we'll keep a close eye on. Jessica Garb live at the state capitol tonight. Jessica, thank you.